Yeah, hello everybody. Today I proudly present version 2 of SCARY. SCARY is a scientific calculator based on uh, this uh, microcontroller ATtiny and uh, this cheap development board. The hardware looks the same uh, like in the previous video. Um, but uh, the version 2 shows a new software and with help of some guys of the HP forum, um, primarily uh, Pauli, thank you very much, uh, I could reduce the code uh, uh, by approximately one kilobyte, which is really much because this AT Tiny uh, has only eight kilobytes of uh, memory. And with this extra uh, kilobyte, I added further functions like the uh, gamma function, and uh, but what's really handy is to use the 512 uh, bytes of permanent uh, memory of this AT Tiny, uh, the so-called EEPROM. And um, one example to uh, use uh, this is to save the state of the calculator. So if you have, for instance, uh, some numbers in here and go to the screen saver with uh, shift shift um, then it uh, activates the screen saver and uh, saves the state the stack and the brightness setting um, to to the permanent um, memory of this eprom so if you switch on later um, you can work from this uh, number on um, Another example of using the EEPROM is to store up to 41 constants or numbers or phone numbers or what else to this EEPROM. So, for instance, if you want to save uh, the, the uh, uh, number of Euler, um, this is one shift menu exponent, 2.71. And if you want to save this to the EEPROM, you should save it first to the memory, shift store, and um, then enter some characters. For E it's 1, 2, 1, enter, for U it's 62, enter, and 56 for the L, so three characters. Then enter um, the slot, uh, one of 41 slots where you want to save it. For instance, it's 11. And then press Shift Save. So what happens is with Shift Constant, uh, you can browse some uh, constants. For instance, uh, the speed of light is, is here, for example, in the slot 1, uh, 0 and there is a lot of garbage in, but in 11 there should be EUL, and if you press enter there is the saved number. So, okay, shift constant. You can go directly uh, to 11 if you press 1, 1, enter. So, and the third example of using uh, this memory is um, here in the extra menu, shift menu up, uh, there is an extra line ABCD, which is a uh, user, uh, uh, which is one of uh, four slots uh, 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 that replay uh, up to 51 recorded key presses. So I call it type recorder. So if you want, for instance, to to record something to slot D, that uh, then enter 4 for D, fourth slot, and uh, press shift record. You see the uh, last decimal, decimal point uh, indicates the recording. So, and if your formula is at 1, that means 1 shift plus, so that's the program, and then press shift record again, so, and you have recorded to slot 4, uh, adding 1. So, if you here have a number 5, you can go to uh, Shift menu up and D, 
then it adds 1, that's 6. So that's very handy because, uh, for instance, I programmed uh, converting from uh, rectangular coordinates to polar coordinates, so I give in the y value of 1 and the x value of 1, shift menu up, and this is in slot 2, that means b, and it calculates the length of this vector, uh, square root of 2, and with shift swap, I have the degrees of 45 the angle. So that's it, really handy. Um, yeah, I, sh I, I changed the keyboard layout too to, um, to get really quick to the uh, recall functions like recall or a constant or a menu. They are close to the shift key. And in this line, there are the record keys to stop, uh, store, to save, or uh, to record. So I think that's all. And thank you uh, for watching and bye-bye.